social media strategy, mission, target groups, and tools. Social media strategy. Social media plays a significant role in communication today, which has an impact on business. Companies can hire employees online, share news, promote new products, compete with other organizations, get direct feedback from customers, and more. To effectively use social networks, it is necessary to create the right strategy based on the company's purpose. First of all, it is essential to articulate the purpose of a business's presence in social media. Thus, the statement should be addressed to a specific audience, describe a particular product, and determine the benefits of choosing it. In this essay, a model of the organization producing ceramics for restaurants, bars, and cafes is used to illustrate a social media strategy for businesses. Social Media Mission Statement The organization strives to maintain the interest of existing audiences through social media, attract new ones, expand customer reach, and increase sales. Thus, it is necessary to inform viewers about products through promo photos and videos posted on social networks. Such advertising will attract attention, customers will be able to discuss it and recommend products to their friends. It is also necessary to post about the company's life so the organization can track incoming feedback on its activities. Through social media, customers should be provided with the support and information they need. Target Groups Research the target audience is restaurants, cafes, and bars, potential second-tier customers, online and offline stores, catering companies, table or rental companies, and corporate clients who are looking for branded products. Reputation and brand awareness, as well as recommendations, play an essential role in online sales to restaurants, cafes, and bars. Thus, it is reasonable to use Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, where people could leave feedback and share information about the company on their pages. This is also true for online and offline stores, table or rental companies, and corporate clients to view information and learn more about the product. The target group's needs are to obtain comprehensive information about the company's product range, wholesale purchasing methods, and the brand's reputation in the restaurant sector. Resources and Tools It is reasonable to use the existing marketing department to work on the presence on social media. Employees are already familiar with promotion strategies that will help them effectively accomplish assigned tasks. The company will be ready to increase its budget by 20% to achieve the goals. It is also proposed to hire professionals outside the company, such as photographers, video creators, and producers. The organization believes that social media presence is essential in the modern world and is willing to spend reasonable resources on developing accounts. Volunteers could be used, for example, to participate in a promotional video. The company is committed to leveraging existing tools, such as Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. In the future, it is possible to use the YouTube platform. It would be advisable to work with social networks and various tools for content management. Social networks will allow one to reach a broad audience, emphasize the target group, and manage tools to optimize the production and promotion of advertising. The most appropriate tools would be Instagram and Buffer for tracking statistics and collecting information. Instagram will allow the distribution of advertising to the widest possible audience and create a brand reputation. However, it does not provide an opportunity to track the feedback. Buffer, on the contrary, makes it possible to monitor statistics and adjust the strategy based on it. The choice of tools communicates the message that reputation and customer recommendation are important to the organization. To conduct promotion, the company chooses Instagram as a platform where it is possible to provide information about products. The important thing is that customers can tell their friends about the organization which will create a reputation in the restaurant industry. Instagram does not require many resources, which is consistent with the tasks set. Twitter can be used to inform the audience about the company's life. The organization can also track feedback here, and it does not require massive resources. Buffer will help track statistics and optimize content. It also does not require special skills and massive resources. Steps and Forecast the company has the resources necessary to start and maintain the promotion. 
For social media to work effectively, it is essential to instruct staff on new goals and objectives, set a budget, and develop a long-term content plan. The marketing department will be responsible for the daily functioning of the media. After considering the steps, it seems reasonable to create a company website where customers can get information about products and purchases, which requires outsourced hiring and a separate budget. The measurement of results should be based on two metrics. First, there is a need to estimate the cost of the promotion and then compare them with the resulting profit. Following the strategy, the company can expect an increase in audience coverage and an increase in order volume, which fully meets the set goals. Assigned roles It is supposed to involve the existing staff of the marketing department to accomplish the assigned tasks. Their duties will include developing and implementing a content plan, monitoring statistics, optimizing strategies based on the data obtained, and defining tasks for employees outside the company, such as photographers, video producers, or volunteers. Thus, the head of marketing is ultimately responsible in the company's social media presence. The steering committee will consist of a CEO, a commercial director, and a creative director. Thus, managers will evaluate the results of the promotion and make adjustments to further strategy.